Hey, this is Rev Todd from Primitive Guitars. I know this is going to be a little bit out of order, but I've had a lot of people ask about back angles, so I'm going to kind of give you a little overview of what I do. Here we go. Okay, so first I start out with the neck blank. I'll go into that later with much more detail. It gets to the point where I've got a fretboard on it, and it's shaped out, looks nice, all that stuff. She's got the nice gap right there. So you can kind of see it's two pieces of wood, bottom, top nice gap one of the boxes i like to use are any box that have the little lip on it in this case i can actually slide that box right under it because what i'm actually looking for <laughs> is just a box that will sit underneath there so a lot of times you're gonna have to notch out the box to get it to sit in there i'd like it to barely touch if not touch at all but what you're looking for is that there's your back angle i cut this thing just to fit into a box and she's got an angle on her so if you got a box that's got an angle she looks like that to attach it you can stick a screw there a couple screws back there these strings are actually holding it in place but it literally is two pieces of wood going down to the end Happens to be a pickup on that one, I'll go into that too. But, you kind of get the idea. Hopefully. Let me know what you, I didn't tell you and all the other crap, and then I'll make a better video later on. But, hold her in, hold her in. If I beat a mugger with this right now, if I was walking down the street and somebody <laughs> came up and tried to take my money, which I don't have, which would be really funny, but... I bet I'd whack him with this and it would still probably stay moderately in tune and intact. So here's your mugger killer version of the guitar. Hope that helps. Please ask some questions and I can try to make a better video later.